Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And in today's video, I wanted to report to you guys that AT&T is actively testing for carrier aggregation and it is headed to devices soon. So I reported this a while back that sometime throughout this year, AT&T would add the fourth carrier aggregation to the network. Now, of course, this is gonna require additional spectrum to be deployed. But if you remember in the past in my videos, AT&T has the second highest amount of spectrum out of all four carriers. So, of course, they can do it. And I think this will challenge T-Mobile in the speed department, in my opinion. Although AT&T doesn't have great density, but with this amount of spectrum and then adding another fourth carrier is going to bring a lot of pressure to T-Mobile. And not only is AT&T doing that, they also have... As you can see, we have rolled out 256 QAMs and 4x4 MIMO in a significant part of our network already. And this makes up some of the functionalities required for 5G. So they are also adding those technologies. And as we get further along throughout the year into next year, I'm sure more of the network is going to get this. Plus 4 carrier aggregation, AT&T with density included. AT&T could very well be the fastest carrier in the United States going forward if they become aggressive with the density and, and rolling this out. Now, of course, T-Mobile is going to fire back. They're going to also include four carrier aggregation with the 600 megahertz once rolled out. But the difference is AT&T has spectrum that can be deployed as of now and doesn't have to wait for it to get cleared. So AT&T would win in that department. So once AT&T starts rolling this stuff out, they could very well be the fastest carrier in the United States. Now, of course, that's just, I'm just speculating this hasn't actually happened yet, but once this is rolled out, the fourth carrier, once the device can make use of it, this is gonna be nice to see AT&T speeding things up. And once again, they're going to bring competition, so that's going to make T-Mobile step up and then Verizon step up as well. So definitely good times in the wireless industry. I just wanted to share this with you guys that AT&T is finally making some moves on the network. I know they've been very quiet lately, so I just wanted to drop that this morning for you guys. So four carrier aggregation coming to AT&T, 256 QAMs, 4x4 MIMO. If you have the S7 or the S8, you can already take advantage of this technology in the markets that they have it live. They don't have any specifics. I've checked. I don't know which markets have it and which don't. Um, so you're going to have to just uh, find out and check with those devices that I mentioned. So definitely stay tuned to the channel. Lots more content coming in the next few days. So definitely stay tuned for that. And... Appreciate all the support. Much appreciated. Shout out to all the new subscribers, new viewers. Like, share, subscribe. This is Tyrone with Tech Life, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.